Hello everyone and welcome to the Gaming by Geeks channel. My name is Adam and once again I am back with some more Minecraft All the Mods 8. So now I need to find a way of getting animals into here. That can be a challenge. But I like a challenge. What I need is a farm. So first I need to build some fence. I do not have anywhere near enough wood. Let's get a whole bunch of woods. J I oh well, actually it's probably more this mod, isn't it? Going annoying. Right, let's see if 30 is enough to make a a small enough fence. If I put the show working area on, I can build my fence around all this box. Because, best face it, you want animals in here, but you don't want them escaping. Now, obviously, I can use the side of the house. That's not a problem. Let's just chop these two off. And you know, I doubt they're going to end up in here, but they might do. Uh, sometimes animals can get on top here, so I might actually have to do that. Just to try and oh, that's terrible. Just try and stop animals from climbing over on top of the machine. In theory, they shouldn't be in there long enough to get there, but. You know, these things happen. To be honest, now I think about it, this is a big space for for animals to be killed, really. I could probably make it a bit smaller and use the, uh, the plus three range on a different machine. In fact, this would be a better space to actually have the animals live, wouldn't it? And then this would be the kill zone. Okay, well either way I'm going to need another machine and it's going to be to do with animals. Did I see an animals? Here we go, optional. An animal feeder, which obviously, as the name suggests, feeds the animals. And the animal rancher, I don't know the difference. Uh, between the what the rancher does, so let's have a look at animal. Cannot spell today. Animal <laughs> rancher. Well, still can't spell. Uh, animal rancher. In that does what did that one do? All right. So the rancher is. Oh, is it? That's a bit obvious, I guess, now. Now I see the shears there in the recipe. Um, it will take things like wool from sheep without killing them. So it's like an automated um, shearer. So what I need is an animal baby separator. So the idea is to have two pens. One pen will have all your animals in it. There will be a machine that feeds those animals. Animals that are well fed will breed and make babies. The babies will then be separated from the pack, taken out and into the mob slaughter factory area where it will be killed for its juices. That sounds horrible, but it's exactly what I need to do. Yes, I am going to be slaughtering baby animals. And obtaining the pink slime that's horrible maybe there's a another thing that that I can do to to stop them from killing the baby animals I and mean, wait for it to grow up and then kill it when it's older but do you know I think that may actually be a thing there are a number of different add-ons that aren't just range speed efficiency processing Okay, there used to be, I'm sure there was one that was 
for like baby animals and, and stuff like that. Is there no longer that sort of thing? Is that not a... Here's all the range. Oh, there's the manual. I should probably get that. Speed, efficiency, processing. Hmm. I wonder if there is something worth looking into. Well, let's not worry about it. Let's, let's let's crack on. Let's get the things that I actually know I need. So the baby animal separator is going to need a golden carrot. I don't have carrots. Mm -hmm. Carrots should be in the fridge. It's where carrots live, right? Right, uh, don't stop doing that annoying thing. Baby animal separator. Bookmark you, because it's annoying when it doesn't. One of those made. I got pretty much everything there. What am I missing in the middle? The golden carrot. Didn't I just make the golden carrot? No, I just I just grabbed the golden carrot. I didn't make it at all. Uh, golden gear and the purple dye. Now surely I can make that from blue and red dye. I have a tulip. Can I put a tulip? Oh, for God's sake! Annoying thing. Can I put a tulip into one of the mechanism machines? I can put it into a crusher. That will just make biofuel. Ah, enrichment chamber. Let's put you into the enrichment chamber. There you are. That will make some uh, two red dye. enough and blue dye it comes from good old lapis so one red one blue equals two purple nice and easy so that hey there we go that is everything well, that was in here I'll also need the feeder which looks almost identical, of course, except for the fact it's an iron gear rather than a, uh, a gold one. So, to do that, a little bit more blue dye. Purple dye, again. So that should be almost everything. Test the baby animal separator. Nearly did the same one twice there. Didn't want that, do I? I want a feeder. Yeah, exactly the same. Except iron gear instead. No, we don't want iron frame. Well, that's a, that's a bug if ever I saw one. Uh, the golden apple, of course. I don't need more plastic. Have I have I used up all my plastic? That went quickly, didn't it? Right, one golden apple, two golden carrots. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll get these done quickly. Luckily, I got all the golden nuggets in the world. There's everything now except for the plastic. So let's go have a look, see how my plastic is doing. Uh, the wood is still there, look it's quite dyed now. It's now stripped. So it's very busy doing what it's doing. Oh look at that, tiny dry rubber, 49. Fantastic. Ok, 
Okay, so five tiny dry rubber will make five plastic. Now, here comes someone. I didn't get to see who it was. I was too busy looking at other things. I'm curious to know what happens when this mob, whoever he may be, or any mob for that matter, walks in front of my uh, mob sorter factory. What's, uh, what effect is that going to have? Very slowly creeping up here. So let me get back in my house and get to my window. Now I'm curious. He's getting closer, he's getting closer. He's up on the land. He's got stuck on the fence. <laughs> Stupid. He's totally stuck on the fence. Of course, he can't get in here. What well, can he? Can he get in here? No, he can't get in here. Let's make you a hole. Can you come in here? He was killed instantly and gave a ton of meat. That, that feels a bit cheaty. I mean, I know I teleport around, but that feels a little bit too cheaty. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> right, there's the animal feeder. Uh, so I need the rancher to complete that, but it's just for a little bit of XP. It's not all of that worth it. Uh, let's see. So the liquid meat and pink slime are coming along nicely. I don't have enough for both just yet, but it shouldn't be too long before I do. So I need a lot more fence. Uh, let's sleep through the night. Get some more fencing. Otherwise I need wood. I don't have much wood in general. How's that doing? Oh, look at that. That's probably just going to be overkill. Uh, hello, leaf cutter bee. Oh, this is empty now. Uh, let's go a little bit further away where I'm not going to be bothering these bees. Don't want to be chopping down any any uh, nests or anything like that. Stupid backpack. So if I do that, that's not much, is it? Let's get some more. Yeah, these trees aren't massive. Oh, that's another 15. That be, that's a healthier amount. That's a bit better. So these back in the system. Not gonna let me do that on you know. It's kind of weird that. Oh well, doesn't matter. Oh am I actually out of sticks? It's an unusual one. I thought I had stacks and stacks of sticks. I guess not. of these still probably not going to be enough it doesn't matter uh, first let's get some food meat right, so this is where the creatures are going to come to die so let me expand my land a little bit uh, let's dig up the sand and replace it with regular earth or dirt if you will. 
Now we need to make a pin for for the animals to to live. Yes, yes, that's right. This is where the actual living quarters of said animals will be. Uh, yeah, let's do. Make sure these are still also dirt as well. Let's do this, 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 and this. So here's a little pen. So right here is where I will put the feeder. So that will feed the animals within the pen. Obviously at the moment it's only got a working area of nothing. Or one. And this one is going to need to go here. Uh, is that the right way? I don't know how that works. Oh, okay, now it has a trigger. It used to just be move whatever and you had to put a, an add-in in. So it can move adults or babies. Cool. Can this, this, this have any triggers on it that I can say don't kill babies? Only kill adults or something? No? Okay. So either way, it will... I don't know exactly how it works, but either way, I think this is the front. <laughs> it will... Actually, yeah, this, will, this will show me how it works. If I do that, hide that, yes. So when it sees an animal in this zone, or once I've expanded it, it will move the babies from this pen into this pen where they will be killed for their meat. So these two both need the same. In fact, let me just grab this one and I'll add it into here so that I can check, make sure that I've got my my sizes right. Look at that, nicely done. So I just need to make a couple of these uh, plus three range add-ons. So for that I need what is it? Four redstone, four glass panes, and a bunch of bone meal, wasn't it? Was it four bone meal? Can't remember. So yeah, I think it's eight in obviously in total. So those are needed along with uh, oh no, it's up again, it's upstairs, I keep forgetting that one. That's got latex in it, good. No, not all of it. There, there we go. Right, let's go and get another bucket of latex. Ready for the second one. Boom, boom, boom. There. Perfect. Two range add ons. So you get one, and you get one. Excellent. Now I've got another issue which you're probably all screaming at me for. Um, these things need power. So I have to somehow get power to them. And what I'm going to do is dig down underneath. And I'm going to take power probably from the main power system inside. I don't really want uh, to be using too much of this one. So do I have my flux ducts on me at all? Do I have any? I've got three. That's not enough. This is where wireless probably would be a good idea, but uh, I haven't got that far yet, so let's just make a box of flux duct again. 
I'm going to need quite a few. So a full stack almost. There we go, close enough for that. So let's dig down. And one more. Okay. Somewhere there it is. So let's join these two together. There we are. Those two are now joined together, and now I will need to go across and into my house, which hopefully shouldn't be yeah, too difficult. There we go. So I can just take the power from here. Uh, let's I'll have to try and keep these things neat. So let's do that. Alright, to try and fill in here a little bit. Then that in, that in, and that. This can come around the corner. Bonk. And attach to there. I don't need to go out that way, so I'm just going to block that back up. Still don't know why that block's there. Did I have a torch there once, maybe? Should probably have a torch down here, shouldn't I? Oh, right, there we go. So now, I should have a mob slaughter factory powered, an animal baby separator powered, and an animal feeder powered. So now I need two things. A way of feeding or getting food to said animals or to said machine. That I think I can do quite easily using a botany hopper pot. So let's quickly bang out one of them. Uh, I need three clay. make some bricks and then do I have any of these yes I do five can go into here keep doing that <laughs> they should go in the top not the bottom so these will make terracotta I'll put these in this one because I can make three at once here a bit faster uh, let's charge you while I wait for a few seconds one, two, three, four, five. And in here should be one, two, three. One, two, three. You, you, and you. Make the hoppery butter pot. And I feel like I've got a hopper sitting around somewhere. Why do I, why do I feel like I had a hopper? There it is. I thought I saw one somewhere. Hopper the botany pot and the hopper becomes a hopper botany pot. And sleep through the night. Now I've got to work out what it is um, that is going to go in there. Let's face it, I mean, just standard wheat would probably be fine, right? And I can then put cows and sheep, I think, in there. So let's put the hopper botany pot there. You and you. They should start growing and drop uh, the wheat into the animal feeder. So now it's time to go and get some animals. Let's just. Lock this back up. We don't want animals falling down there, do we? So, 
animals this way apparently let's what do we think would be better cows or sheep I think personally cows I and the only reason I say that is because well they're a bit bigger so I assume that means they'd have more meat perfect there are a couple right there thank you cow you're about to be put through hell sorry about that so let's there you go enjoy you should uh you should hopefully have some some meats and stuff to eat or some wheat you eat wheat right you eat wheat well i'll we'll find out in a minute when i bring over cow number two which was also over here is it still here or has it run away there's a few here Hello cow, you look small. <laughs> Did that cow say no? That's what it sounded like. Second cow is in. Now you two. Do you, ah, uh, you do eat. You two make a baby. The baby will be transported from one side to the other, who then immediately walks out. <laughs> I need to put some more fence there. See what I mean about the animals escaping? Hey, get back. Right. Not the plan. Oh, and he went, and of course he was then chopped up. Right. Just stay there, cow. I'll go and get you a, a friend. <laughs> Whoops. See, that's what happens when you don't plan these things properly. You. Thank you, cow. Hey, no, no, no. How did he get out? Get back in there. You're getting out on that hopper botany foot, aren't you? Right, fine. I thought that was going to be a really good idea. It seems that cows can walk through hopper botany pots. <laughs> right, you two, behave. Eat your food. Mate, make a baby. And, uh... Actually, you know what I can do? I'm going to turn that off for now. And I'm going to let these cows breed. Because, obviously, just two cows only making a single baby cow every 10 minutes is going to take forever. But if I let these two breed, let that baby cow grow up, yeah, I know it's all weird, but eventually I could have, you know, 20 cows in here. And... 20 cows making 20 babies is going to be way better. So, guys, I will leave you to it. I'm going to make some form of chest. Actually, I don't know if I need a chest necessarily, but I need a pipe for the, uh, the stuff to come out of. So, let's make an item pipe. They're weird. And droppers for item pipes. Fair enough. I mean, got to make them somewhere, haven't you? Uh, do I still have my wrench? I do. So let's have I need a hopper bossy pot. Where's it gone? There it is. The seeds and the dirt. So if I do that, can I do that? Yes, I can. Excrement. And there. 
So now that should continue to feed the animal feeder here uh, with its wheat seeds. So we'll see soon enough. And hopefully, when I come back in a couple of minutes, there should be a baby in there. Or, or yeah, depending on how long it's been, it could just be three cows if it's already had a chance to grow up. Let's have a look. So, how far have we gone? So, I am waiting on slime. I need a bucket, which is a, a thousand miller buckets. But I do need one more thing apart from that, and that is a simple machine frame. So, let's go make that while we wait for cows to procreate. So again, it's yet more latex. Once again, that is not that machine. <laughs> I'm terrible at this. Oh, terrible, terrible, terrible. Useless. Uh, right, so I need... What is it? I've already forgotten what it is I'm looking for. A simple machine frame. Oh, machine frame. That's you, right? So that still needs a pity machine frame. It needs some plastic. It needs some nether bricks. Interesting. And a gold gear. So the gold gear. Let's put some of this stuff away now, actually. Buckets. I don't need the tiny dry rubber. I don't need the fence anymore. My wrench can go back in this box. I don't need the end uh, animal thing. There, that's a little better. Uh, right, so where was I? The nether brick. I don't have nether bricks, it seems. So that's alright, that's just never rack and smelted I believe. It certainly used to be anyway. And it still is. Uh, I needed the pity machine frame. Bang out one of you. I needed the other nether brick. And then I need two iron and two plastic. Two iron, two plastic. Right, that's all I need. Let's go and bake that. So that went in there, didn't it? I don't actually know if this actually makes a difference, to be honest. Let's see what happens. No, it's, it's shapeless, so that's good. I haven't got to worry about that. So let's bang out one of you. Three, two, one, boom. Simple machine frame done. Oh look, I can look at here and see if there's anything going on. But you can't see anything, so that's good. So XP levels plus one. Oh see, that's not XP, got like 100 XP, that's a full level. That's generous. So now that I can make simple machine frames, that's unlocked all of this lot. So mob detectors, all these different mycelial generators, and fermentation station, hydroponic bed. Oh, I don't know what half of this stuff is. <laughs> I need to go through the manual and see what all these machines do. So I need my pink slime. So how's how's things getting along? Out there, I'll put you in there for now. I don't need my nature's compass right now. I think it's the rest. So, you and you are easy enough to go. And you, we've got some food. Oh no, that was a mob drop, wasn't it? Again, more food, food, food. You are. You've got 
insight. What's what's insight? Oops. Increases experience. I'm not fussed about that. So that one can go in there. There's no space for a lot of this stuff, is there? And a couple of gems. Right. That's everything. Sleep through the night. And let's see how we're doing out here. All right, we have a baby. So, and it hasn't been moved yet because this machine here is, despite the fact it looks like it's on. Oh, look, we have two babies. Good. So, I need them to grow up now. And, uh, and become adults, and then I can have two breeding pairs of, of, uh, of cows. The animal feeder is working wonderfully. That's all automated, so that will just keep feeding the animals forever and ever. Happy little critters that they are. Oh, hi, Martha. Oh, yeah, I didn't see you there. You're just going to sink, aren't you? Come on. Get here. How much more do I need? I've got enough for the liquid meat, but I don't quite have enough for the pink slime. Die. Oh, look at you. You made it out. Die. Oh, you dropped a spade. How helpful. This tool can place a torch. Interesting. 